Hello everyone, in this video, I will show you that how you can find information about a particular gene, the information about its exons, its introns and other informations. So for this, we can use gene database, how you can use gene database and how you can analyze its results. So that will be clear in this video. So let's move to the computer screen. So here in order to open the NCBI, just open your browser and search for the NCBI and now just open the home page by clicking here now just to show you I am going to open a gene so for this just select this gene database and here just write the name of gene like for example I am writing here HBB human means human that is hemoglobin beta gene of humans and just search it as I search now it will show this hemoglobin gene present in human so this is the first option that is hemoglobin subunit beta gene in homo sapiens means humans and hemoglobin is also present in other organisms so it is also showing the result of like this mouse rat and so on but i am going to show you this human hemoglobin gene so just to open the gene data click here as you click here so a new window will open which contain the complete data of this gene so how to read the data here this is the official symbol that is HBB which I just used during the search this is the official full name of gene hemoglobin subunit beta gene and these are the database which contain this related information gene type is protein coding because this is hemoglobin gene so it definitely code for the protein that is hemoglobin this ref skew status reviewed means this data which the data which is showing here it is reviewed by the NCBI and it is highly and you can it is annotated now this is the organism means homo sapiens as i told i am search for i have just search for the homo sapiens genes this is the classification of this gene like eukaryota metazoa core data so this is the complete classification of homo sapiens and this gene is also known by this number this is the summary this summary it include the structure of this hemoglobin beta gene the function of this gene so this just all included in this summary now as you comes down so here this is the data which show about this gene so in this this is this gene is located on the chromosome 11 at the position this and this is the uh, you can say direction in which you have to read these uh, red arrows this is the direction to uh, read it now if you come to the graphical form here this is the complete information of this gene this green bars, these thick green bars, these are the exons and while these thin green lines, these are the introns. So you can see that this gene, it contain 1, 2, 3. It contain 3 exons while it contain 1 and 2, 2 introns. So exons are the coding region and introns are the non-coding region as you all of you know. So how to know about a specific information for a specific exon? or intron so in order to get information just place your cursor on that exon or intron and just within one or two seconds it will show you the new window which contain the complete information of that particular selected exon like here i just opening the information of exon 2 here you can see that the gene is hbb which i just show in during the introduction and this is the basic information like this RNA title, protein title, hemoglobin, subunit beta, this is the accession number and so on. So this is all information about this exon you will get. Similarly for in case of intron, you can also get information by placing your cursor for 1 to 2 seconds. So this is the information about this intron. So this intron is of the gene hemoglobin beta. You can also select this intron or exon so in order to select if you just want to uh, zoom this one if you just want to clearly see this second exon so in order to zoom it just place your cursor press your left click on the mouse and just drag it drag it to the portion of which you want to amplify or zoom in so for example i just want to zoom this much portion now just this portion is selected now right click and there are lots of options you can select a spe specific range you can also zoom in zoom zoom out and this zoom on range and you can also perform the blast searching of this particular selected exon like this option blast and primer search here it will select this particular exon will be 
uh, use for the blast searching by this option similarly you can also design a primer by this primer blast selection so there are lots of option and this is zoom on range means if you want to zoom it like just i'm clicking here so now you can see that this exon 2 is now zoomed in earlier it was a very small but now it is very much clear and a bigger in size here this find option in this if you want to you can jump to a particular nucleotide so if you know the position of that nucleotide you can either enter it or if you want to know then like for example if you want to know that which nucleotide is present at 100th position so just type here 100 that is 100 and press enter as you press enter so it will bring you to 100th amino acid if it contain 100 amino acid then it will bring you to 100 amino 100th amino acid similarly if you search for other like for example if you want to know the 15th so just click 50 and press enter so now it will move you to 15th position so this is which by you can you can say you can move jump to a specific uh, nucleotide here like in if you see if uh, you can suppose you want to know about 10th position so click here now just 10th so as it is you can jump to a particular uh, nucleotide so these are certain other tools which you can explore this is the graphical summary and of course this is the bibliography means where this hbv gene has been uh, used or you can has been discussed so this is the bibliography so by this way you can know about the introns exons of a particular gene or basic information about a particular gene so that's all for today guys see you in the next video thank you very much